second semi-final of the night. Alessio Sacchetti already fought at Honor in the past edition. Let's see how he's getting along tonight. and sprawls here. Seems none of the two wants to get on the bottom, so they had to fight for the top position. These guys weigh in at uh, 70 kilos as per uh, the previous fight. So they probably hydrate a little bit more. Some good activity. Great to see such uh, such confidence to have a crack standing up. Oh, so tap it yeah, inside the uh, leg. Almost kick. got it. Yeah. But Keith back up. that went viral uh, I can't remember who it was one of the UFC fighters was uh, wrestling one of those uh, monster Murky, uh, Jiu Jitsu boys that cleared that arm yeah, in the meantime Alessio gets a takedown but Keith rolls well for the heel hook this could be a problem yeah Alessio defend but over and over spinning Keith don't have the heel, but it's still there. Ah, he lost the toe, so nothing there. So now he got it back now. And they're out. And they're out now. I think this count was an attempt. He had the heel. Keith likes the bottom position this time. Probably got confidence from the previous action. The athletes now they're exchanging legs attacks or leg setups, let's say. No attacks yet, but the setup is the first part. Yeah, it's nice to see now a different dynamic of the game. <laughs> it's a good thread through. Very good to get out of that and keep yeah. a nice control. You can see they don't really care for the position, they really go for the attacks. Yep. 
which is nice. More well, action. Hopefully, they've been watching from the back, and uh, they can see, uh, yeah, that this sitting on their uh, sitting on the on the tatami and doing nothing. Of course, and it's very interesting to see what the judges have to say after all these exchanges. Oh, very hard to judge, in my opinion. Got three unanimous, yeah, to Keith. black flags. Keith is our black athlete. Alessio is the white one, so Keith is the favorite so far. I try to block that leg, but looks like it's not a problem for Keith. It is uh, so great to uh, really see the sport evolve into uh, what was, you know, like, oh, almost like an um, almost gets an omoplata. Yeah, like he defends well with the knee. Good attempt, though. Yeah. But watching, uh, yeah, watching the sport from you know what was considered you know a, a dirty component to attack, you know you don't attack somebody's legs. To now it is uh, so accepted that it's such a technical uh, component of jujitsu, and there are so many variations and so many styles that you have to be able to uh, be aware of. As you can see here, it is uber technical. Of course, Neil, that's actually a new word there. Uh, it's own word. The leg attacks. Yeah. If you, you step on the mat with one of these guys and you don't know what you're doing or you've never trained that or, or drilled that, they will sub you so fast. Yeah. Matter of seconds, really. Yeah. There's this crazy banana berambolo out the backside, round the side, and all of a sudden they're on your heel and you're like, what the hell happened? And here again, I guess you try to hang on the, on the arm, just not high enough with his hips. Yeah. Interesting how Alessio is blocking the hip with the bottom foot. I haven't seen that tonight yet. Yeah. It's a different style. Everyone else was crossing. You're right. You hear more leg entitlement. Super, super shallow though, unfortunately. Attacking the other foot now. Yeah. Almost looked like he was trying to hit in a steamer lock there, no? Yeah. Oh, can he get up? No. Keith get up, but still guard to pass. Yeah, I don't think we will see many guard passes here, uh, rather uh, legs attempt. At least that's what we've seen so far. This is great, they're looking for the win. It's yeah. really good. The winner actually will go against Fabricio in the final. Nice, deeper sort of entry there, trying for that, but just a little hard to maintain it. It was a nice entry attempt there, my Alessio. It was good. He's starting to uh, ramp up the uh, the attacks a little bit more, and it's uh, fishing a bit. <laughs> the guys are right in front of the uh, our booth now.
Kiev tried to get the top position, I mean, passing the guard. And Alessio tries on his own as well. 50-50 guard. It's so difficult to be able to keep that uh, that leg in there, you know? Yeah. And we've got three black flags again. Yeah. Unless you really need to push this fast in these last five minutes. Yep. And they're right on the edge of the mat here. I'll be surprised that, uh, I mean, but they're in pretty good control. I'm surprised if the ref haven't moved them. There we go. Yeah, I think you just to avoid the situation where like yeah. there is a good attack and they had to stop. Yeah. But they were set when there is nothing on yet. But it's interesting, the boys compared to the other matches, the guys were relatively in control with the mat space they were doing. I think the ref was well aware of that and uh, was letting them work even though they were so close because they haven't shown a, uh, a, a penchant to be able to move right over to, uh, to one side explosively and land on somebody's uh, table. It's a nice output there, increase. They're, they're definitely up the pace a little, no? Yeah. This last uh, four minutes. Yeah, I'm sure they start feeling a bit tired now. Yeah. Will we get a sub? That's what we want. Something for the highlight reel. Oh, we have plenty of highlights here, but yeah, not the finish yet. See, I want a sub, Seb. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see a critical setup, good control. Three minute mark now. Mm. Listen, and top and and just sits for the submission. You know. <laughs> There's a quick uh, attack at the toe there. Keith escapes that. <laughs> you want to be careful uh, oh. kicking, you know. Yeah, playing the leg attacks is also getting harder and harder with the sweat, even more than all the other positions. It's too easy to escape. Mm. He's looking for that uh, um, plata sweep just to uh, keep him away. Ooh, vain attempt at a toe hold. Abandons that idea. Wow, these guys twist out of those uh, sub attacks so quick, huh? Yeah. Mm. Lots of calls from uh, both corners reminding the athletes that there's only uh, two minutes to go. Yeah, that's the best time to push it. Especially when the other athlete is also tired. Eh? It's the time to try. What risk taking will we see? Will will somebody have a go? Yeah, I think that the, these athletes started very high pace from the beginning. They're feeling quite tired now. It's more or less you should push it more because I think he was the least favorite. Uh, but the problem is you you push it more and you know you've still got another match. That's true. That's true. This is still a semi final. Yeah.
So these guys, they get, they get nice entries, nice catches, but just slip straight out. Mm, it's unfortunate. Last uh, few seconds of the match here. Can we get an entry? They're both uh, having a push there. It's quite deep. Yeah, nice. this is time his last try. He yeah. has the heels. No, he hasn't yet. Ten seconds to go. Can Looking he, for it. He needs to stop him spinning. Better keep that knee. Yeah, he spin once That's more, and he's out. Very good, you boys. Just thumbs up. Great effort. The winner is Keith Creek.